Hi, I'm Martin from Printer Potty. This video demonstrates a problem we've seen a few times now where trying to use the WIC reset utility on a Windows 11 computer will sometimes lock up whenever the user tries to either read or reset the waste counter on their printer. The issue doesn't always appear and may not be limited to Windows 11, um, but we wanted to recreate the problem and show you how we've been able to solve it so that you can too if you should hit the same issue. As you can see here, we have the Epsom XP55 printer installed, but it's actually got the default Windows 11 driver. It's the one that Microsoft provide with their operating system. And as you can see, has minimal functionality and features. If you have this driver installed, chances are you don't have enough functionality for the WIC reset to be able to access your printer and communicate properly. Yeah. Start up the WIC reset. The printer is turned on. It does have a waste ink error. Okay, um, so I'm going into the WIC reset and I'm just gonna close the system for this session. But I'm just gonna try reading. If what you get is a little sort of like circle, which is going round and round and round and round, and nothing is happening, what you actually need to do is install the full Epsom driver. So. You go to epsom.com or .co.uk forward slash support. So whichever one is your Epsom website, okay? Go to support and then you type in your particular model number. Click on the correct listing for your particular printer. And then the thing you're looking for is the drivers. Okay, click on that and then grab you don't need to necessarily grab the most recent driver, but this is all you need. You don't need any of this other stuff here, okay? Just click on driver, download. Wait for that to finish downloading. And then open file. Just minimize that. You may get a prompt requiring you to give admin access to install the driver. You will need to have admin access to install the driver, by the way. Uh, I'm not gonna set it as the default, but this is the correct one. So there you go, click okay, and then wait for the driver to install. Here we go, right. It's now waiting for me to turn the printer on. So I'm going to turn the printer on now. There you go. It's seen where it is. It's installed the full driver and we're now good. So if we now go back to Bluetooth devices, printers and scanners. And if we now go into printing preferences, now you see all of these other options, including maintenance. Now, one thing we need to do here while we're here is actually disable status monitor. Okay, so we go into extended settings, locate the tick box which says enable Epsom status monitor. Now your one may actually say disable Epsom status monitor. If it says disable, tick it. If it says enable, untick it. The bottom line is you don't want Epsom status monitor three to be running, okay? So I've clicked on, well, I've unticked enable status monitor, clicked OK, clicked OK again. And that means I've not got the status monitor down here and I don't have to worry about it. OK, so now that I've done that, I can minimize that, I can now run Printer Potty again. I can close Assistant for this session and now I can click on read waste ink counters. Once you've done this, all you've got to do is click on reset waste counters, enter your key as normal, and then reset the waste counter as shown in our other videos. As you're about to see in the blooper reel, um, yeah, this video actually didn't go to plan. The XP55 in this did actually work absolutely fine with the default driver. I just had to edit it to recreate the scenario that cropped up with a customer's um, laptop and uh, XP 960, if memory serves. Um, but wanted to get this out here, so if you actually hit this problem where 
WIC reset just locks up, um, you've already tried antivirus, you've tried everything else, then drivers is the next thing to do. Installing the full driver seems to work, solves the problem and gets you up and running. Okay, anyway, thanks for watching, enjoy the bloopers and uh, see you in the next one. Bye bye. I'm just going to try reading the waste encounters. <laughs> and of course, on this machine, it works absolutely fine. So, <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um.